Hello viewers, welcome to linuxhelp.com Today we are going to see how to install Grunt and Grunt CLI on Ubuntu 16.04 Grunt is a JavaScript task runner which helps in performing repetitive tasks This means that a developer can save time and spend it doing more useful development work So let's get started Usually Grunt and Grunt plugins are installed and managed via node.js package manager So the first thing to do is install node.js Node.js is available in Ubuntu repository with the required dependencies. You can install it by using the following command. Node.js as well as npm. Now the installation is complete. So let's check the version of the Node.js and npm. Here you can see the version of the Node.js and then let's check the npm version and you can see the npm version here so let's proceed with the installation procedure of grunt and grunt cli and uh, before that check if npm is up to date So the npm is up to date now. At this point it is possible to install a grunt and its CLI. Run this command to install a grunt. Now the grunt has been installed. So let's proceed with installing a grunt CLI. Sorry for the previous error. Now the installation would be fine. Now the Grunt CLI installation has been done. Actually the job of the Grunt CLI is to run the version of Grunt which has been installed next to your Grunt file. This allows multiple version of Grunt to be installed on the same machine simultaneously. And then now in order to create a new project, first create a new folder In this folder, you have to execute a npm init command. Then enter the required information like project name, author, a git repository, version, etc. etc. You can even simply skip. So press enter and it will create a packet.json file with all the information you entered. Now you just have to add a grunt to the project. It is also possible to define custom task right inside the grunt file. So that's it for now. And this is not a detailed guide, but because grunt is an extensive project, even uh, Twitter used this project with many plugins and a lot of options per project customization. But the simple configuration example shows how repetitive tasks can be automated, giving developers more time to work on improving the project implementing ideas, etc. So thank you for watching this video. Hey, if you like our channel, please don't forget to subscribe. For more videos, please do visit www.linuxhelp.com and also mail us to support at linuxhelp.com for further queries.